I guess let's start this shit up. A little bit about myself. I am 21 years old, about to be 22 soon. Um, I'm originally from Dallas, Texas. And I am currently living in the happiest place on earth, Orlando, Florida, working for... This is actually my apartment for, for the next uh, 13 days, and then, well, you guys get to go with me on a whirlwind adventure. Um, hopefully. Um, it'll be interesting for me, hopefully for you too. Uh, I'm honestly just glad that I have somebody to take with me on, on the journey. I get to show you what it is that I do. It's gonna be weird looking to my brain. For me as well as you guys, I guess. Uh, technology's wonderful. We get to be so far apart from each other, and yet I'm sitting here talking to you. Uh, well, not you. I'm talking to a camera stacked on a stack of video games and movies, and uh, it's just fascinating to me. It's it's wonderful, actually. Um, um, you you all did embarrassing stories, and uh, I guess to follow that one up, um, I guess I'll go along with that. Um, so, in, uh, in sixth grade, sixth, seventh grade, something like that, I wasn't a very, uh, popular kid. I was kind of just that weird guy, I guess, and I never really got invited to go do anything or hang out with anybody. I didn't really feel like I had a lot of close friends at that time in my life, maybe one or two. But I got invited to a pool party that summer, and I got really excited because I've never at that point been invited. Anyway, so my mom dropped me off um, at this pool party, and, I got, and it was really interesting because like there was a lot of people there, uh, like cool kids, like kids that would not normally talk to me, and so I wanted to show off a little. I knew that you know I was pretty athletic, just didn't really show it off, and there was this there was this girl there. I remember she was like my my crush at the time and she was just a gorgeous little sixth grader and I shared a cheese stick with her or something and was smitten and I had a huge crush on her so I wanted to show off just for her and so I got up on his diving board and I, I got up there in like my manly pose and I bounced once and hit the board and, and, and did a front flip and dove right into the pool and it was in my head at least it was a perfect dive no splash perfect tense from the judges even the Russian and I hit that water feeling great. And I came up out of the water and got to the ladder and thought, you know, they would just be cheering and, like, applause. And it would be like a standing ovation for me being wonderful and I'd be a popular kid. I came up and <coughs> everyone was, uh, was laughing at me. Apparently, my swim trunks were a little too big. And they were floating in the pool behind me. So, I really showed off that day. Uh, I was exposed to my entire sixth grade class. Luckily, luckily I moved to uh, Colorado the year after that. By the way, I left I'm winning. my fears atop 